Hi guys, this is Carlotta Winston with you during the month of May. I can't believe we're already here in May. But this month, we're choosing to highlight mental health awareness. I don't think we can talk about this enough. Uh, I know for me personally, going through last year in the pandemic, losing loved ones, still trying to balance life, being a mom, coming to work, it can be so overwhelming. Um, so it's so important for us to find time to take care of our mental health. Um, and today, I'm definitely wanting to highlight why it's important to create that one-on-one -on -one time with yourself. I think oftentimes it's so easy for us to give and give and give to others when they need help, whenever they're in a mental crisis or financial need or if they're hungry, whatever the need is, that we put ourselves on the back burner. Or, hey, let me speak for myself. I've done that before. And before I knew it, I would have my own crisis where I would break down, cry. I would feel the weight of the world on my shoulders. And I knew then that I had to create time for myself. So what can that look like? That can look like you taking a walk for 20 or 30 minutes on your own. That could be you listening to your favorite songs in your favorite location in your house or walk, walk listening to music. That could be you painting or going on a trip or I like getting my nails and my feet done, so go into the spa. Whatever it is that brings you peace, creating that time for you. I'm going to leave this last tip with you. There's 24 hours in a day. Pick one of them for just you. No kids, no work, no bills, no stress. Just you and yourself. All right, guys. This is Carlotta Winston with UNC Health, leaving you a healthy tip of the day, or the week, rather. And we'll see you next week. Thanks.